Hey, nice to see you again. It's great to be here. Now we're going to talk about blogging. So, you know, blogging is an online method for communicating to a wider audience on issues that you care about. Blogging started as a way for people to drone on and on and on about their life experiences. But thankfully, it has evolved into a more diverse communication medium for individuals, educators, and corporations, and that stuff's kind of boring, but we can skip that. The corporations, that is. Educators are interesting. Anyway, as an educator, blogging is a super way to post important events in your classroom. It could be pictures or videos of things that are just happening, or something as simple as a place to post your homework. All of my students are required to have a blog, and they love it. Really, they do. They post nearly all of their writing, all of their work, all of their videos, all of their pictures on their blog, and depending on the assignment, other students are required to read their fellow students' work and post a comment or two. This two-way communication gives the students valuable, usually, feedback about their work and how it is seen by other people. Lastly, by having students post their work on a blog, it creates an electric portfolio that they can share with their family. It's something they can potentially keep for the rest of their lives. One day they'll come out and thank you. And as teachers, that's really what we want, right? For students to come back and say thank you for helping me.